watching your every smile like your television In your eyes I see myself unfolding Make it make sense, it must be the temptation speaking What am I supposed to do, cause it feels so good Feeling wild like a super me in a mood Should've known that it ain't real How'd you know how to get into my feelings? You're a trip giving me hope and solution Hope and solution Maybe I should've known that here in North London and everything points to an exciting contest. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson and what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Well thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Well, they're going to set up as a 4-4-2, which means the front two will need to be clever. Must be! And a goal right off the bat. No wonder they're jumping for joy. McCabe. Williamson. On to Meade. Mornum. And space to cross it. And thumped away.
Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Mornum. Frida Mornum. Kurtig. Dangerous looking through ball. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. And still dangerous. Threat over for now, it seems. Ella Toon. Good ball over the top. Is this the moment? Well, it might still work out for them. Determined defending. Maritz. Russo. Frida Mornu. Katie McCabe. And promising stuff from Arsenal. How about the cross? Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Great defending. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. That's a good ball. Well, not cleared away completely. Well, the pass got in the way. It's an obvious offside. Mornum. Lina Hurtig. And she moves the ball with intent. And there's the feed into the box. And it's gone in. Beyond the goalkeeper, Arsenal level. Thomas. Soon. Martha Thomas. Can she put it away? And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Good ball to switch the play. Illestet. Portig. Well, here we are, moving close to half-time, and Arsenal chasing the game. Stuart, what have you made of their performance to this point? Well, it's been a good game so far, and they've played a big part in that. But if they are to get back into this, they need to be more disciplined defensively. They've just been to... So the match has restarted here in Manchester. Throw in to Manchester United. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Little. Passing it around as the search goes on for an equaliser. And look at that, a goal here for Arsenal, who now have got themselves on terms. Playing advantage here, United keep it. Ivan Afuso. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. how to do it inside your own penalty area Kim Little Russo now a decent position Leah Williamson Little chance here got to it well they haven't created too much lately but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here an alert reaction to tip it over and smuggled behind for another corner not to be in terms of the finish
Arsenal regaining possession. Good through ball. And that is offside. Well, as we've seen, Arsenal have dominated the ball in the last 15 minutes and have looked great going forward. They just need to take one of the chances they've created to get themselves ahead today. Well, just look at that reaction. What a challenge that is. And knocked out of there. Leah Williamson. Now with Mead. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Not made it look routine, but read it well. 20 minutes to go. Teammates available. A oh, tremendous vision. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Beth Mead. Breaking at pace. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. Well, she's been cautioned now. Good referee, and you've got to say. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, she tried to keep the header down, but couldn't do so. But once she gets there, Derek makes decent contact. She's got to head that one down. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Miedema. Manchester United venture forward. Do they have a winning goal in their future? Kim Little. Russo. Thomas. Very quick thinking there. Chance here. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. A very timely interception. And that'll be a United throw. Ella Toon. Well, that's how to outwit your opponent. A oh, tremendous block. They have to show a commitment to attack Arsenal in these trying circumstances. This could level it. So the referee's whistle means football. It's a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. Now
senses that you can't confess I'm just your ghost if we're not undressed A part of me wish that we never met But you act like we never Got to waste it in the bathroom of your parents' house Then you kissed me in the backseat of a taxi ride And we said things that were cheesy But we meant them that were feelings And now you deny it you're in love with the idea of me But you're not in my reality Find it hard to leave a picture in Cause my reality is your reality No cities london and ready and good evening to you from this beautifully appointed stadium the home of arsenal here in north london i'm derek ray in the commentary position and alongside me is the former arsenal and west ham midfield player stuart robson and we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today it's arsenal taking on chelsea thanks derek well both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly pinning the opposition back playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully we get a really good game here. Ingle. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Oh, this is looking promising. Superbly read and executed. Really nice ball. And out for a throw in. Just misfiring with the pass. Said really well to get through. Well, not very. A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what. You can hear a pin drop in here. Little. Russo. Here's Little now. Oh, chance perhaps. Oh, great block. Good all right. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Lina Hurtig. Me. In position. And look at that. A goal here for Arsenal, who now have got themselves on terms. Ingle. Hurtig. And space to cross it. They've regained possession. And passing it through. Ingle. Can she put it away? And what a magical save it was! It's a short one. Looking to cut inside. Still alive. And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage! And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. Maritz. Frida Mornu. Portig. Options in the middle. A fine use of the ball. And it's opening up. In it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. Lawrence. 
Now here's Kerr. Katarzyna Svitkova. And the pass deftly cut out. And that is offside. Maritz and Little and the right place to cut out the pass and there we have it the first half so the match has restarted here in Manchester Teammates available. Happy to shoot. And it looked as though she was going to score again and would have scored had it not been for the goalkeeper. Yeah, but I think she should have scored. That was a... Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know... That... Oh, good save. Excellent header. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front in this game. Kept it out and cleared it away. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Oh, moving it nicely. Can they forge ahead? And the deflection there before it went over the byline. Going to be a corner. Well, the header needed to be a lot better than that. Didn't really make the keeper work. On a pass that lacks quality. Alessia Russo just moving back into that deeper position. Little. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Keeper getting the touch. Well, threat averted. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same. Well, we can give them high marks for their passing, but can they make this pressure count? A Chelsea corner. And a decent delivery. Wonderful header. Excellent goalkeeping. Kurtig. And Little. Viviana Miedema. Noel Maritz. No panic, just passing. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Oh, skipping away. Getting forward. And pulled back. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. 20 minutes to go. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Can they nudge in front? And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Kerr trying to open up the defence. And she's hit it with power, just wide, however. And the keeper might pay the price. Russo. Decent looking pass. You don't want to give the ball away there. Alessia Russo. Big chance. What a block. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. She has teammates around her. Still level. And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Oh, yes, what a pass. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Can't miss. A goal! They've done it on the rival's home patch. Will that be the decider? Maritz. Leah Williamson. 
time and the scoreline against Arsenal. But still they're in this. Katarzyna Svitkova. Well, we look towards the referee because she might decide that further action is required. Yellow card earlier. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Miedema. Can they convert? Brilliantly blocked. So the referee's whistle means full time and it goes into the books as a defeat. I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it conceding so late on.
Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks for. Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation, but played well, it can be really... And danger still! Well, thank goodness for the goalkeeper. Well, they're calm now, but that initial save was absolutely magnificent. Lauren James. Now, who can she pick out? Could be! A oh, tremendous block. Nikita Paris. Well, she keeps moving. But the danger averted for now. Good idea. And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all. Ella Toon. Given away by Manchester United. Ivana Fuso. Good looking move. Is it going to be? And what a magical save it was! Who can they pick out? Outrageously good piece of defending on the line. Ingle. Katarzyna Svitkova. James. Nikita Paris. She has teammates around her. And crossed in there. It could be... Oh, tremendous goal! Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. Svitkova. Sophie Ingle. Abdulina. What can Chelsea do from this position? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Martha Thomas. Takes aim! And placing it against the post! Well, she thought it was in, and so did I. She's very unlucky not to score there. Buchanan. Now with Lawrence. Lauren James. Really good interception. Martha Thomas. Could be. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, another corner following on from the last one. Not all that convincing defensively. Shaping to shoot. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Ashley Lawrence. Lauren James. Oh, good vision. And he stopped them in their tracks. Skipping away. This attack looks highly promising. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Good or right. Options in the centre. And that will do it. Well, underway once more into the second half. And from a Chelsea point of view, it's all about battling back. Well, there to intercept. A 
has a go. Well, I'll tell you what, that didn't miss by much. Svitkova. And an astute piece of defending. Well, that's a super ball over the top. And the decision is one of offside here. Chance to play it in. Not all that hard to deal with crosses like that. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Nicely blocked. They won't complain about having won the corner. And maybe an opportunity to... And still a chance. Just knocked it out of there. Well, that save could be the turning point here. Because they've been second best all over... Oh, look at this. They must score. And a goal here for Manchester United. They are the big favourites now. Ashley Lawrence... And moving the ball nicely. Well, honestly, I didn't mean to jinx them. This wasn't a very good pass, finally. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Intercepted effortlessly. Teammates available. Oh, given away. Has a go. Determined defending. Another block. Svitkova. Lauren James dangerous looking attack could reduce the deficit oh a stellar piece of defending now we're inside the final 15 minutes real chance oh and there she is at the double now a two goal contribution she's stamping her authority on this match Brighton. Beautiful pass. Shooting chance. Opportunity. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Ivana Fuso. And a tidy challenge. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Fuso. And thwarted there following the cross. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. Well, thumped clear. Kerr. And the cross comes to nothing. And there it is, the full time. They were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a great performance.
Tension is palpable and you can understand. Ideal weather, no complaints on that front here in North London at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers, and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Well, they're going to set up as a 4-4-2, which means the front two will need to be clever with their combination play. Dynamic with their movement and energetic with their closing down. I'm looking forward to seeing them play here today. Little. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And that's easy peasy for the keeper. Ella Toon. It's a fine United move in the making. Well, nothing comes of it. Referee indicates goal kick. Leah Williamson. And a throw in here for United. Ella Toon. Fuso. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Soon. Must be! Oh, mischievous attempt. Oh, we have just witnessed a special moment. Pure quality. Mornum. McCabe. Frida Mornum. Lina Hurtig. Mornum. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. That was going in. Fuso. Well, really on top of her game. Smuggled away. Kim Little and a strong tackle nicely cut out fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection so now a throw in
the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out Fuso Portig getting forward might lead to a chance well what a stop that was well just listen to the crowd they know this is a big chance to equalize and over comes the corner and still an opportunity the high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle happy to shoot and it's gone in beyond the goalkeeper Arsenal level So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Kim Little. On to Miedema. And tidy defensive play. The tackle completely mistimed and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And danger averted. Well read. Frida Mornu. Well, that one has promise. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Spot on with that tackle. Beth Mead. Need an encouraging Arsenal move. Well, we saw what she was attempting with the ball at her feet, but it didn't quite work out. Amanda Illestet. Here's Little now. Alessia Russo. Maritz. Well, nicely cut out she fancies it well the post getting in the way there well Arsenal was so close to taking the lead but if they keep making chances and play as they are doing it's surely only a matter of time before they do so yes so near indeed but now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape can they forge ahead they do and you've got to say they're good value for the lead Noel Maritz outrageously skillful well pass after pass maybe they can chisel an opportunity cross towards that far post not all that convincing defensively into the final 20 minutes good through ball What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. Viviana Miedema. And passing it through. Oh, yes! Dispatching it with a plum. Wonderful goal. Soon. Jade Revere. Ella Toon. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Well, the Arsenal fans can sense a winner coming here, but can they create one more big chance? Manchester United on the front foot in the closing moments. Can they find a winner? Leah Williamson Alessia Russo an encouraging Arsenal move could play it in cutting in oh genuine chance and a goal 
at this stage of the game, it might be decisive. And just look at their supporters. Fuso. Manchester United battling the clock and the scoreline. Teammates available. There will be one minute added on at the end. Really nice ball. And the referee blows for four. There was very little in it for much of the game. I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least. And it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on. But they just have to bounce back now.
occasions such as this one. Good evening. Tonight, the spotlight falls on North London. We find ourselves at the home of Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And a fantastic diving save. And there's the delivery. Well, you have to categorise that as a missed opportunity. James Svitkova Kadisha Buchanan and Chelsea moving the ball forward what can they do from here must take the lead here well somehow the goalkeeper got to it and over it comes well still an issue here well, it comes to nothing in the end. There to take it away. Ashley Lawrence. Svitkova. Sophie Ingle. No chance, perhaps. Little. Katie McCabe. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Nice looking pass. Might take the lead. Oh, keeper dealt with it. Over it comes. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Corner awarded to Arsenal. Not all that convincing defensively. Reading it well. Really good build-up, but no end product. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. Well, it looked so promising, but it all comes to nothing. Well, the keeper didn't have too much time. Well, as we've seen, Arsenal have dominated the ball in the last 15 minutes and created a hat full of chances. But when you're enjoying that amount of possession, you need to make it count. Yes, yeah, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Well, I'm not sure the keeper particularly wanted that, but danger averted for now. And Chelsea have given it away. Lauren James. Showing real patience. Can they forge ahead? Oh, a goal! There it is! And the crowd stunned into silence! Kim Little. Well, that ball looks promising. This looks more than decent. Can she get them level? And it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. Ingle. And Chelsea looking dangerous. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Lauren James. Could be threatening. A pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Played into the centre. And they can't quite take advantage in the end. Well, they get the ball rolling once more. 
Chelsea in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this is over. Well, high marks for that pass. She's made a really important challenge. Genuine chance. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. Monu. Here's Little now. Well, she's certainly not alone. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Delivering it into the box. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. Frida Mornu. Chance to play it in. Fine build up as they look to add to their advantage. Viviana Miedema. A really good pass. Went in strongly, decisively. Katarzyna Svitkova. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Oh, surely. And Chelsea have done it. It's going to be so difficult to stop them now. Little. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Viviana Miedema. Trying to open up the defence. And running in behind. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Not a poor touch and unable to keep it in play. Throw in to come. Katie McCabe. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Crucial piece of defending. Abdulina Guro Wrighton over the touchline for what will be an Arsenal throw clean challenge promising pass Beth Mead The clock is against Arsenal, but what can they pull out of the fire here? Well, she knows what she's doing defensively. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Oh, great vision. Oh, and you know what? She's been a bit unlucky there. Well, it's a good effort. Difficult technique, but it's just off target. Me. Well, these Arsenal fans still believe they can get back into this, but they're going to have to throw everything at it now. Time is running out. And we will have just one additional minute. And the flag does go up offside. So the final whistle now, and disappointment for Arsenal, you've got to say. A it was a poor result, but it was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances, could have gone either way, but in the end, they will be disappointed.
Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways And on Well, you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the Theatre of Dreams, Old Trafford. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual play. And it might be. Opportunity still there. And a goal! Just what the fans wanted to see. The ideal way to begin. Ella Toon. Given away by Manchester United. Sophie Ingle. Svitkova. Timely intervention. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Ivana Fuso. And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. Can they square the game? And a goal here. Just what Manchester United required. They are level. Buchanan. And given away. Is it going to be? Nicely blocked. Great moment. 
And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Katarzyna Svitkova. Carter. James. And beating her marker. And it's happening up. It's still alive. Alsu Abdulina. Can they create something from here? Well, despite creating chances, Chelsea still find themselves level at the moment. But credit to the keeper, that was a great stop. Yes, end-to-end -end stuff, but now they're forced to track back. Oh, great defending. James. Oh, tremendous vision. Cuts it back. Can't miss, surely. Now just the tackle that was needed. Oh, nice ball over the top. Well, Chelsea did well to regain control of it. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. And that is offside. Ravia and Paris is this the moment oh really commanding goalkeeping Sophie Ingle Lauren James promising move ball is loose cuts it back Chance still on. Well, that's a really top-notch piece of defending. And no problems at all for the keeper. Well, just trying to drive her team forward here. Play towards the back post. Sound piece of goalkeeping. And so the first... Second half here at Old Trafford has commenced. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Intense pressure. Really clever pressing. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here. Well, not cleared away completely. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Room to roam for Chelsea on the wing. There's the cutback. Brilliantly blocked. Now can she get on the end of this one? And the alarm bells are ringing. Oh, mischievous attempt. Oh, she's finessed it in. Brilliant chip. Ashley Lawrence. Svitkova. James and in the right position to read it on she goes in possession they've only gone and grabbed another one two goals in quick succession now they have the lead no wonder they're celebrating now Chelsea in a position of menace but the danger averted for now. 
Ella Toon. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. That's a good looking pass. Can she put it away? Oh, goodness me, off the post. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Well, so unlucky not to score there. So close to reducing the deficit. Perfect tackle. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Thomas. Firing it towards goal. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Who can they pick out? And holding on to it at the second time of asking. High pressing and good high pressing. Trying her luck. No way through. Well, not far away from full time now. And United excelling here. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. And just five minutes remaining. Oh, good vision. Able to close down the shot. Ivana Fuso. Now will the cross work out for them? And you need your defender to take charge. And there it is, the full time. It's a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. Of a taxi ride, 
understand why two high level sides always a terrific venue to watch a football match i'm talking about the emirates stadium here in north london i'm derek ray ready here on the commentary position and alongside me is the former arsenal west ham and commentary midfielder stuart robson and what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action it's arsenal versus manchester united thanks derek well both managers will be reminding them is this the moment still could be dangerous in it goes at the second time of asking and the keeper feels hung out to dry Noel Maritz Monum and Little Frida Monum Hurtig well, off target by Miles with that one, and a goal kick will ensue. Martha Thomas. Oh, that's a really good run. She's made a really good intervention there. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Beautiful pass. Very alert defending. This could be the equaliser. Well, what a stop that was. Ella Toon. That's a good ball. Not away completely. But it wasn't a straightforward save, but credit to her. So the corner played into the box. Well, not cleared away completely. Maritz and Little. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Can they take advantage? Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. 
Frida Mornu. Now here's Miedema. McCabe. Lina Hurtig. Oh, great vision. And a decent save. Full credit. Martha Thomas. Ivana Fuso. Well, the keeper's eyes were on the prize, in this case, the ball. Well, nearly at the halfway stage in this one, and Arsenal with a bit of heavy lifting to do if they're to get back into this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've been outplayed in this first half, and they need that half-time whistle to come soon so they can regroup, change one or two things tactically, and come out with a better attitude in the second 45. Distributing it well. Oh, a golden opportunity for her. And a goal this time. Applying the finishing touch. Just what the doctor ordered. Katie McCabe. Using space on the opposite flank now. Amanda Illestet. Mornum. And there it is, the referee's whistle, the first half. Of... Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. Oh, good looking run. And it's come off the keeper. Well, they can bring it out now. Well, I have to say, United have been a joy to watch today. Just look at those stats. They've been in complete control. Sloppy in possession from United. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Beth Mead. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Oh, skipping away. Now can they counter clinically? Can they use it to their advantage? That's a useful cross. Well, unfortunately, it fizzled out in the end. Mead. On to Miedema. Good effort here! is a sensational strike and many will have questioned the wisdom of having a goal from there I'll tell you what, she's glad she did, what a goal Arsenal regaining possession Beth Mead just trying to keep their opponents on their toes with the passing game well they've really turned this into a contest Momentum now with them. So back in action, and Arsenal just one behind now. Oh, a goal! What a comeback! Who on earth could have predicted this? Nikita Paris. Well, going to work and beating her opponent. Could take the lead. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. <laughs> 20 minutes to go. Can they forge ahead? And it looked as though she was going to score again and would have scored had it not been for the goalkeeper. Yeah, but I think she should have scored. That was a big chance for her to get a second. She'd probably regret that shot now. And intercepted it. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. 
And she's trying it from distance. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. And the ball in behind the defenders. Alessia Russo takes aim. And what a magical save it was. A perfectly taken corner could make all the difference in this game. This one for Arsenal. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. Ivan Afuzo. Running room galore for United. Well, you can see how fiercely they're concentrating on finding a winner. And there's the feed into the box. Appear to be in two minds. And problem solved for now. A very good tackle. Mead. Oh, great vision. Well, the keeper kept her wits about her at this crucial stage of the game. She certainly has. That's a top-class save by a top-class goalkeeper. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Well, smuggled behind for another corner. Playing it in. Immediate priority to clear the danger. Beth Mead. Well, showing everyone her abilities in possession. Well, possibilities inside the box. Well, good defending, clattered out of there. And there's the referee's whistle.
Wondering how to make a play all night Flipping your way from out of sight Thinking I should ask if you're doing alright You weren't easy and so hard to ignore Pull up on your right Ask what you're drinking, ask what you like Such a look good in the dim bar light So damn cheesy Who'd have thought you'd fall for somebody like me? When you ask my name, I panicked So what am I late? It's never dull when these two London sides find themselves on a collision course. Arsenal, well, no doubt about it, gunning for victory. The home side tonight, we're in North London, the home of Arsenal. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Svitkova. Takes it on! And able to close down the shots. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, it's the same system, so it's very much about the individual battles. The team that wins more of those should dominate and win the game. Leah Williamson and Chelsea with the ball again. Oh, a golden opportunity for her. Oh, a goal! They strike first, and what a way to silence the crowd! Noel Maritz. Arsenal have given it away. Might work out. That is really alert defending just when the situation looked dangerous. Plenty of support here. could level it and it is the equaliser parity now and who's to say what's going to happen next Sam Kerr Abdulina Sophie Ingle that's a good ball must take the lead here and they have You've got to say, it has been coming. Amanda Illestet. Frida Mornu. Miedema. Katie McCabe. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Well, high marks for that pass. Remy Sam defending. Could play it in and drawing it back. James, rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. Is it going to be? And it's gone in here. Just what Chelsea fans wanted to see. The lead extended to two goals. Alessia Russo. Frida Mornu. McCabe. Lina Hurtig. Leah Williamson. Katie McCabe. Looking for the final pass that will open things up. Distributing it well. Magnificent challenge to win it back. It's really opening up positively for Chelsea. Oh, fancy footwork. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Maritz. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Kim Little. Electing to shoot. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. 
Well, could this be the turning point? The fans are certainly hoping so. So, half-time, that will close the book. So, back underway here, into the second half. Good ball over the top. Opportunity here. Oh, a superb save. Beth Mead. And Chelsea winning the ball again. Svitkova. James. Sophie Ingle. And it's a penalty. The referee points to the spot. And it's going from bad to worse. And the keeper denies them from the spot. Top corner it is. That's an effective cross aimed at the back post. And she scores. It's gone in. And now she can run off and celebrate. Could be dangerous. Is she going to finish? And the keeper more than equal to it. So the corner played into the box. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, as you can see, Chelsea have been really good going forward. They've created so many chances. And if they score again soon, this could get embarrassing. Leah Williamson. McCabe. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Svitkova. Smuggled away. And Chelsea have given us away. James. Svitkova. Chelsea couldn't maintain possession. The referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. And she puts it away confidently. A goal from the spot. Just what they were looking for. Arsenal have given it away. Nice weight on the pass. And nearly the ideal ball. But a good piece of defending. Noel Maritz. Here's Little now. And she's in a decent position. And there it is! And no wonder she's off celebrating. Svitkova. On to Lawrence. Katarzyna Svitkova. Lauren James Ten minutes to go Space and time for Arsenal Just like that they've grabbed another one and who's to say they're not going to come back again Lauren James now here's Kerr. Good idea. There it is. Victory more or less guaranteed now. And cutting it out. Could be threatening. 
But no, just offside. Well, it was close, and it is offside. The assistant got that absolutely right. Out of play for what will be a Chelsea throw. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Full time then, the referee's whistle, and it's a win for Chelsea. That's the big... Absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. Let the rhythm move us, yeah baby, take it too far You're at the center of my attention, yeah you got me so lost I love the way that you move, and how the lights keep up the groove We're like in a move, baby, but it's ending too soon And welcome everyone to England's Northwest. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. It's Manchester United taking on Chelsea. And a good take under duress there. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4 4 2. And it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. 
Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And a goal! They start as they mean to continue. They make the opening statement. Good old Wrighton. What can Chelsea do from this position? Regained possession. That's a good-looking ball. Could be. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. They do pass the ball with authority. Kerr. Opportunity here. There it is. A goal to reduce the arrears and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, they get the ball rolling again and Chelsea are giving this a real go. Svitkova. And a lot to like about this attack. Martha Thomas. Ella Toon. Here's Paris. Thomas. Gives it a go. No way through. United looking to forge ahead. Let's see if the corner helps them. It might still be problematic. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. Able to close down the shot. Sam Kerr. And Chelsea sloppy in possession here. It's a fine United move in the making. Soon. Will it be? Jess Carter. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. And can they prize them open now? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Can't miss, surely. Looked like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. And Chelsea could be onto something. In goes the cross, but absolutely no support there. Martha Thomas. Encouraging stuff from United. Laid into the box. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. James. Svitkova. And so the referee blows the whistle. Well, the action underway once again. And work to do for Chelsea in this second half. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Nice looking pass. Ivana Fuso. And she couldn't keep it in play. Goal kick. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? A fine reading of the situation. A chopping challenge. And the referee has got to have a big think about it. Soon. Ah! 
And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. 30 minutes to go then. Danger averted for now. Oh, stylish ball. What can they do now? This could square the game. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Manchester United keep the ball. Advantage. Revilla. Showing a real will to win the ball. James. Good weight on that pass. More than decent passing sequences, but they need a leveller. Well, it's gone in. A goal for Chelsea, who now are level. Ella Toon. Could be threatening. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing. And now they sense victory. More than decent this from United. Now sliding in field. Well, the attack carried an initial threat but fizzled out. Brighton. Sophie Ingle. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Defenders need to cover. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. What can she do with it now? Could cross it in here. And it's opening up. Oh, she's done it! She's made it a hat-trick! A milestone occasion for her. And she deserves all the credit going. Maya Letizier. Very quick thinking there. And so there it is, the final whistle, and man... They weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team, and they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out.
the kind of match every football fan looks forward to a lot delighted to be able to report very agreeable weather for the fans here at the Emirates Stadium my name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me ready to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson and we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today it's Arsenal taking on Manchester United well thanks Derek as always the scene is set two good teams a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it's a fairly standard 4 4 2, which you don't see that often, but it does have its strength, particularly with the front two they've got playing today. They're both good players. Well, the fans wanted to take on the shots. Oh, a smart stop. Let's see about the delivery. And defending right on the line. Good tackle taken away. Little. That's a lovely ball. And clears the danger. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. Well, it's the same system, so it's very much about the individual battles. The team that wins more of those should dominate and win the game. Released it nicely. And she's alone in the middle. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Soon. United might be able to cash in. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Delivering it. Just wanted to get it out of there. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Shaping to shoot. Magnificent defending. High pressing and good high pressing. It should be. Crucial piece of defending. Making progress. But quick thinking defensively. Nikita Paris. Now, brilliant work to keep that one in play. Wasteful from United. Maritz. Monum. 
Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Determined defending. Advantage, Arsenal. Opportunity here. And hit with real authority. Off the bar. Goal kick it'll be. And tremendous individual skill. Well, good run, this. Now, what can she do with it? Little. Kurtig. Breaking at pace. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase. Oh, a goal for Arsenal. It's theirs to lose now. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. Katie McCabe. Maritz. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, Interesting to see how this second half pans out. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Miedema. And having a go! But the keeper takes charge, and it was pretty straightforward. Options in the middle. And there is the goal! Wow, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. So the match continues and United just one behind here. Mornum. Well, fine use of the ball. Nice looking pass. She fancies it. Wonderful block. Well, defensive resilience there. Very quick thinking there. Alessia Russo. 30 minutes to go then. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Passing it accurately. Is it going to be? And it's gone in for Arsenal. Will they be stopped from this position? Ella Toon. And it might be a favourable situation, this, for Manchester United. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Maritz. Here's Little now. McCabe. And Little. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Viviana Miedema. And quite simply, wide of the target. Jade Revere. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Soon. Oh, it might be. And off target in the end. And that'll be a goal kick. Illestet. Maritz. Frida Mornu. That's a good looking ball. And players waiting at the far post. Danger averted for now.
And the counter-attack is on. Options available. All hands on deck. Tremendous block. Must be. Oh, good work by the keeper. Who can they pick out? Terrific piece of anticipation. Maritz. Now oh, the pass not finding its target. And support available. Delivered into the area here. Well cleared away. Five minutes to go. Russo. Now can they counter clinically? And possibilities inside the box. Must score! Well, she was in position to grab another one, but not to be. But it's only a matter of time here. She looks so dangerous at the moment. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Great opportunity! And a goal! She's thrown her team a lifeline. And so that is that. It was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory.
on a collision course Arsenal. we're at the home of Arsenal here in North London and everything points to an exciting contest I'm Derek Ray and delighted to have Stuart Robson sharing commentary duties with me and we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you it's Arsenal taking on Chelsea well Derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game An Arsenal corner, and heading it just over the bar. And hit with ferocity! Well, the elements of surprise there. Well, it's great technique as well. She really did strike that well, just off target. Really good challenge. Mead. Now here's Miedema. Electing to shoot. Oh, good save. And there's the delivery. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Corner awarded to Arsenal. Half hearted clearance. Plenty of support here. And it's a quality pass. Mornum. Little. Now here's Miedema. McCabe. Now Chelsea showing good width. And space to cross it. Beth Mead. Cross could be useful. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Save, but still a chance. Well, no way through in the end. Well, Arsenal's build-up play has been excellent. Just look at those stats. But their finishing just hasn't matched their approach play. They need to take one of these chances, and fairly soon. Well, they need the ball once more. They know that full well. But it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Can she find the right pass? Lina Hurti. Oh, big opportunity! There it is! The first goal in the derby! A special moment! Maritz. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. Little. Noel Maritz. Frida Mornu. Can't miss, surely. It's still alive. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Now, can they hit them on the counter? And promising stuff from Arsenal. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Well, they have it again. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. 
and defensive play to be applauded and the whistle is sounded for half well the action underway once again and work to do for Chelsea in this second half Moving the ball nicely in search of an equaliser. Opportunity. Well, it's gone in. A goal for Chelsea, who now are level. Noel Maritz. Arsenal have given it away. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee. Katarzyna Svitkova. Magnificent defending. Good looking sequence. Me. Well, it's one pass after another. Now, who can she pass it to? Every pass hitting its target. But then the one that goes astray. The Chelsea move still flowing. Advantage to them. It should be! And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. An alert piece of defending. Noel Maritz Williamson now with Mead Illestet Russo well very effective play in possession and that brings the attack to an end free kick to Chelsea Sophie Ingle moving the ball more than decently but can they take the lead well it leads to the goal that puts them ahead simple save really Katie McCabe Portig could cross it in here Incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. And a corner coming up for Chelsea. Can they make good use of it? Playing it short. And the cross into the middle. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. Genuine chance. And that's two for her today. They just can't contain her, and no wonder she's off celebrating. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Amanda Illestet. Miedema. Time and the scoreline against Arsenal, but still they're in this. Alessia Russo. Well, possibilities in the centre. Can she put it away? And a decent save. Full credit. Well, time running out for Arsenal. You felt that had to go in. Not much hope for them now, but credit to the keeper. What a great save that was. And promising stuff from Arsenal. Decent looking pass. Oh, it's a goal! to match the moment Svitkova James and just one minute of stoppage time say the officials and the whistle is sounded and these two teams are locked
Uh, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype. Has... And welcome everyone to England's Northwest. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It's Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Oh, might be. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, it's great to see them playing with the front two, but for it to work, they need to have a good understanding. They need to link up with each other and provide a different set of skills. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, it's the same system, so it's very much about the individual battles. The team that wins more of those should dominate and win the game. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Into the advanced position. Might jump in front. And the keeper more than equal to it. Over it comes. Oh, yes! Dispatching it with a plum. Wonderful goal. Abdulina. And taking it away. Thomas can she score well somehow the goalkeeper got to it now sending it in good piece of defending now Chelsea in a position of menace this could square the game and she's missed it! Good heavens! Well, chances don't come better than that, do they? What a miss that is. Well, she keeps moving. Well, let's see about the cross. And they deal with the threat this time. And the referee has given the corner. So maybe scope here for them. Oh! Wonderful goal! Kerr. Ingle. Ball played nicely. Well, potential danger. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Oh, a golden opportunity for her. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Let's see about the delivery. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Oh, cleared away. Superb defending. Massive credit. Well, the woodwork has just denied them a three-goal lead here. But you just can't see them throwing this one away, can you? Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. And United will get the throw-in. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball, but they've shown a real lack of creativity today. They need to be far more inventive in the final third if they're to turn things around here. That's right, and priority number one here. Oh, such an elegant finish! How about that on the volley? A brilliant strike, whatever way you look at it. Sam Kerr. And unable to keep possession. Nicely done to get past her marker. Crossing into the middle. And after the cross, defensive action called for. Lauren James. This is looking threatening. So no more time left. That... The second 45 minutes then here at Old Trafford. 
And with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. Feeding it through. Could be a chance. And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Given away by Manchester United. Lauren James. Oh, surely! Able to close down the shot. Now this could really lift spirits. Brilliantly blocked. A chance to whip it in. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. What can she do with it now? Decided to come in from the flank. And it might be. And able to close down the shot. Fuso. Well, going to work and beating her opponent. And does well to keep it in play. Could pull one back here. And what a magical save it was. Playing it short. Delivered into the area here. Can she slot it home? And getting in the way of that superb defensive play. And threading it through. Oh, well hit, but couldn't keep it down. Not a great pass. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. A glorious chance. Oh, off the post, still alive. Full credit, wonderful stop. Regained possession. Sam Kerr. Crossing opportunity. And to reduce the deficit. Another goal, and I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible. Soon. Given away by Manchester United. Ten minutes to go. Katarzyna Svitkova. The clock is not on Chelsea's side, but it's not over for them. Well, it's astonishing. A very unlikely comeback. But now they are level, having trailed by three. Soon. Manchester United venture forward. Do they have a winning goal in their future? And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. And the ball in behind the defenders. And still dangerous. And she's hit it with power, just wide, however. Good distribution. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And the referee signals that the... It was a tight game between two very good sides, but they lost concentration late on, and it's cost them dearly. They'll need to get over that quickly.
Wondering how to make a play all night Looking your way from out of sight Thinking I should ask if you're doing alright You weren't easy and so hard to ignore Pull up on your right Ask what you're drinking, ask what you like Said you look good in the dim bar light So damn cheesy Who'd have thought you'd fall for somebody like me? When you ask my name, I panic So out of my league And your body was so magnetic before I knew it, we talked and I think about you a cocktail You told me that you'd been waiting for somebody like me To the city, how would you let somebody so pretty? Is what they said to me. Yeah, that's what they said to me. Well, they told me I didn't stand a chance. Yeah, face value had you at a glance. Yeah, but nobody ever asked if you could dance. Yeah, well, the only one who did that was somebody like me. When you asked my name, I panicked. So out of my league. And your body was so magnetic. Before I knew it, we talked and I think I bought you a cocktail You told me that you'd been waiting for somebody, somebody like me Somebody like me The stadium is buzzing already and with good cause. Two top sides ready to go at it. And a warm welcome from North London. We're at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, it's 4-4-2 against 4-4-2. You don't see that very often these days. Oh, Stewart, an opportunity! Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Now sending it in. Not the best clearance. Oh, chance perhaps. What a block. Opportunity here. Oh, she's missed it. Big chance to open the scoring. And she'll be disappointed with that. Maybe that came a little bit too early for her. Kim Little. McCabe. Hurtig. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Well, disappointing end to the move.
Amanda Illestet. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. McCabe. Noel Maritz. Now this could be productive. Portig. Every pass hitting its target. Are they going to forge ahead? And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. United might be able to cash in, but really sticking to their task defensively. Takes on the shots. Well, an effort that was pretty close in the end. Well, she makes such good contact with it. Hits right through the back of the ball. Just can't get it on target. A really good effort from her. An attack full of promise. Opportunity here. Squanders the chance for 1-0. Well, that's a big miss. They should be leading now. Amanda Illestet. Maritz. Mornum. And Little. Frida Mornum. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. So underway again here, one nil the score. Turner. Really committed herself to the tackle and a throw in now. Lily Turner. Soon. Thomas. Oh, this is looking promising. An alert piece of defending. So on the cusp of the half-time interval, it's Arsenal holding the edge here. Stuart, time for your assessment of what you've seen from them. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half-time if it stays like this. Well, an attack that lacked that final punch. Oh, great piece of individual skill. Perfect challenge. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. It's a fierce effort. Goodness gracious me. How about that for technique? You can't strike them much better than that. And there we have it. The first half action is over. So the match has restarted here in Manchester. Need. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Now, can she put this one away? Well, that's not an attempt she'd like to have replayed over and over again, is it? Well, I think she got caught in two minds. Was she going to hit it with power? Was she going to pass it beyond the goalkeeper? In the end, she went for power, and the result is it goes horribly off target. Could be. And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. So continuing with the action, United still behind, but this game very much a contest. And the flag has gone up, offside. Illestet. On to Miedema. Maritz. Williamson. Frida Mornum. No chance, perhaps. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. Effective challenge. Well, United are hanging on here. Had they gone two down, they would really be up against it now.
Well, understandable that they might look a bit frazzled defensively, but they have more work to do at the back. Now, maybe room here for the counter-attack. All hands on deck. Wonderful chance. Oh, a challenge of the highest order. Running room galore for United. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Can she get them level? Oh, good save. Excellent header. Opportunity maybe for United here. It might still be problematic. Prepare to take on the shot. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well smuggled behind for another corner. Not away completely. Well, they can bring it out now. Williamson. An encouraging Arsenal move. Decides to shoot. What a commitment to defending. Just 15 minutes remaining. Arsenal recovering possession well. Now, who can she pick out? It's a perfect challenge. Well, not much time left now, and these Arsenal supporters are doing everything they can to get their team over the finish line. What an atmosphere. Oh, yes, what a pass. And she's produced a really important save to keep the pot boiling here. Well, there's not long left, but she's kept her team in this one. That's a great save by the keeper. Could play it in. Played towards the back post. Making sure nothing came of it. Maritz. Now with Mead. Kim Little. Beth Mead. And played in. Miles off target with that particular header. Well, the defender did just about enough there. A difficult chance in the end, I would say. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. And the referee blows for full. Certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me. And obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. It's right, right.
on an occasion such as this one. Well, no doubt about it, gunning for victory. The home side tonight, we're in North London, the home of Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary. And alongside me is Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Corner kick given to Arsenal. And short it is. Plattered away. A oh, chance perhaps. No way through. And there's the delivery. Clearing it away. Given away by Chelsea. Kurtig. Advantage, Arsenal. Promising looking ball. Well, she's having a bash. And danger still. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates. But what a first save that was. Meet them up. Lots of space for Arsenal. Opportunity to go ahead. Really sound defending. And fine goalkeeping. And the referee remaining very much in control. Now the card, and it's yellow. Who can they pick out? And the danger's still on. And Chelsea have given us away. Mornum. Options in the centre. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Well, what a glorious chance to grab the first goal of the contest. Well, you have to say that's a wasted opportunity to get their noses in front here. Golden opportunity. What can Chelsea do from this position? Well, this could... Re real chance. And it's in! 1-0. They've breached the defence. Williamson. Katie McCabe. Leah Williamson. And Little. Miedema. McCabe. Now here's Miedema. Katie McCabe. Viviana Miedema. Well, not precise enough with that attempt at finishing. Guro Wrighton. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Flag raised for offside. Frida Mornu. Alessia Russo. Wonderfully weighted pass. And the cross not quite accurate enough. Lawrence. Lauren James. Good looking pass. Now the cut back. And Chelsea have done it. It's going to be so difficult to stop them now. Katie McCabe. Noel Maritz. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And credit due, a good intervention. Very surely a chance then for the respective managers. So back in business here, and Chelsea dominating the proceedings in the first half of this game. 
Will we see a similar pattern in the second 45? Maritz. Williamson. Frida Mornum. Wonderful chance. Oh, tremendous goal. Technical excellence to finish that one off. Wonderful to have that in your repertoire. So back at action, and Arsenal just one behind now. Little. Katie McCabe. Possession and patience, the watchwords. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. James. Sophie Ingle. Oh, surely. And an astute piece of defending. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. It does appear to be opening up on the flank for Arsenal here. Beth Mead. The cross is on. Change the equation. Ashley Lawrence. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. And a really single minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Noel Maritz. Alessia Russo takes the shot well, she really hit it with authority but not quite on the target well we have 20 minutes left in this game Lauren James chance to cross must take the lead here and danger still and into the net she's going to be delighted with that but the goalkeeping a different story. Kim Little. Good visualisation and execution. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. Ashley Lawrence. Katarzyna Svitkova. Now who can she pass it to? And with that, the attack fizzles out. Just ten minutes to go. Me and beating the defender. Decides to shoot. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. the perfect position to read it five minutes remaining and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close little well this game is ebbing away and Arsenal have still got a lot on their plate well they're still in with a chance here but can they produce one more big moment before the end Mind you, this has been a really good game. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And that is that. The referee brings this match to... They didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win.
the kind of match every football and here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world Old Trafford in Manchester I'm Derek Ray ready to bring you match commentary and alongside me is Stuart Robson and what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action it's Manchester United taking on Chelsea well Derek we can talk about coaches and their methods but it's now down to the players which ones are going to stand out, who will affect the game, and who will have the greater desire. It should be a cracking game, though. Crossed into the penalty area. Splendid defending. The lineup for Manchester United. Well, if they're going to play as a 4-4-2, they must make sure they stay compact out of possession and then stretch the pitch when they do have the ball. How they play in transition is going to be key today. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, it's 4-4-2 against 4-4-2. You don't see that very often these days, but I'm sure they're going to see slightly different versions of it once the game gets going, particularly in the wide areas. This is looking threatening, and let's give credit to the defending. Oh, danger here. That was going in. And a short corner, let's see. Delivered into the area here. Did well to clear it away. 
giving the ball to the opposition that time shaping to shoot what a block showing real patience can they forge ahead Puzo theme emerging of wasted possession Brighton Katarzyna Svitkova went in strongly to win the ball Kerr well doesn't have to do it on her own and under pressure that was a fine claim Ella Toon Paris it's looking promising an alert piece of defending Alsu Abdulina given away by Manchester United Katarzyna Svitkova Fed forwards. Paris. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Oh, she's in a really promising position. Oh, such a high class volley off the charts in terms of quality. And that's one she's not going to forget in a hurry. Thomas and that will do it for the first half here well underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half options in the centre good looking move and it's opening up they just couldn't stay in front, and now this match is all square. Nicely cut out. Martha Thomas. Firing it towards goal! But the keeper takes charge, and it was pretty straightforward. Guru Wrighton. Wasteful from Chelsea. Nikita Paris. Opportunity! And it wasn't a straightforward save, but credit to her. Now the quick counter-attack could be on. Well, it looks so promising, but it all comes to nothing. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Getting in there to intercept. Thomas. Soon. And successfully cut out. James. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Still looking for space. Well, she's made sure nothing untoward happened. Good idea. And now waiting to pounce. Oh, and there she is at the double now. A two-goal contribution. She's stamping her authority on this match. Sophie Ingle. Has eyes for goal, and a goal! An end-to-end -end game, and they weren't behind for long.
Ivana Fuso. Ella Toon. Fuso. Now there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Opportunity. Oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack. Could be a chance to break here. Crossing opportunity. High quality defending. Ten minutes left for play. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium. But can they find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Giving it a try. Stopped a surefire goal. Well, I thought we were going to get some late drama here. United were so close to taking the lead. This is going to be a great end to the game. Yes, so near indeed. But now they've got to concentrate on keeping their defensive shape. No way through. Chelsea have won themselves a corner. Now what can they do with it? Ingle. Well, it's pass after pass, keeping their opponents thinking. Can they forge ahead? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. And there's the referee's whistle.
Every football fan looks forward to a lot on the line. And good evening to you from this beautifully appointed stadium, the home of Arsenal here in North London. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And what we've got on the menu is potentially absorbing league action. It's Arsenal up against Manchester United. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, great plans. Opportunity! Oh, goodness me, off the post. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, Arsenal have started this game really strongly. They've passed it well, they've created a couple of chances, and they were so close to... A glorious chance! Crucial piece of defending. Let's see about the delivery. Struggling to get it away. Well, nothing untoward happened. Soon. Fuso. Will it happen for them? Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Lina Hurti. Monum might be onto something with that ball. Well, nothing to split the two sides, but this move looks promising. Could still be dangerous. Might take the lead. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Martha Thomas. Soon. And beating her marker, but a good piece of tidying up. Maritz. It is a decent looking attack here. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Has eyes for goal! Touched onto the woodwork. Well, thank goodness for the goalkeeper. Well, they're calm now, but that initial save was absolutely magnificent. Little. Me. Here's Little now. Beth Mead. Oh, what a top notch pass. Is it going to be an opportunity? And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Ivan Afuzo. It's a fine United move in the making. Oh, good-looking cross. This could level it. Well, simple for the keeper. Alessia Russo. Arsenal have given it away. Could be. Oh, good work by the keeper. Delivering it. Still not clear. 
That's a good looking shot. Well, she didn't miss by much, did she? Respectable effort from there. And that's because she's got such good technique. She strikes it so cleanly. That's a really good effort. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. It's going to be United's free kick. And did just enough defensively. Corner kick for United. Can they take advantage of the situation? Not the best clearance. And having a go! Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the... Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. Takes aim, and it's in, a goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. Good ball to switch the play. Kim Little. Mornum. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. Advantage, Manchester United. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, not an attempt she'll be especially proud of. Goal kick. Released it nicely. And threading it through. And able to close down the shot. Individual brilliance. And a throw in for Arsenal. Arsenal's free kick here. Maritz Russo looking for a teammate oh good save well they've been frustrated for quite a while now but these fans have suddenly come to life and that's a straightforward stop well as you can see this has been a fairly open contest chances at both ends plenty of good attack in play and it's been really entertaining well, she was hoping perhaps not to have to blow the whistle, but in the end, it will be a free kick. Soon. Here's Paris. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Timely intervention. Twenty minutes to go. Illestet. And the danger cleared. Little. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. They keep plugging away. A chance to whip it in. Looking to cut inside. It might be. And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve. Nikita Paris. Time is against Manchester United, but it's not over for them. Great opportunity. Couldn't put it away, and that could be so costly at this juncture. Yeah, that's so frustrating. I'm not sure they'll get another chance to get back into this game. Illestet. Frida Mornu. Now, options are plenty. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort, though. A really good pass.
Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? And there to intervene. Mornum. Oh, genuine chance. And there she is with such an important save, and they're still alive. Yeah, she's produced a great save there, but are the team good enough to go and get that equaliser? I'm not sure they are. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. So, two minutes to be added on at the end. Russo. And so that is that. Play a lot better than they did today and not win the game. But they stayed focused, showed a lot of character and eventually got a very good result. when these two London sides find themselves well no doubt about it gunning for victory the home side tonight we're in North London the home of Arsenal 
I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst as always on these occasions is Stuart Robson and we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you it's Arsenal taking on Chelsea well thanks Derek in position that was going in Maritz and a look at the Chelsea starting 11 well, it looks to be the same system here, so it's just a case of which team presses the ball better and which team can get their wide players into more advanced areas. There are some good matchups here. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Alessia Russo. Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. And Chelsea have given it away. Well, she had the confidence to take on the shot. Buchanan. Guro Wrighton. Svitkova. Sophie Ingle. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? Good weight on that pass. Katie McCabe. Oh, that's an interesting pass. And offside it is. Intercepting it intelligently. Illestet. Kim Little. Amanda Illestet. Lina Hurti. Not a poor touch and unable to keep it in play. Throw in to come. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Rather than a free kick, it's advantage Chelsea. And a timely intervention. Lina Hurti. Space and time for Arsenal. Electing to shoot. It will be Arsenal's corner as they try to nudge in front in this game. Can someone get on the end of this? Danger still on. Kerr. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Svitkova. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Fed over towards the back post. Not really the ideal clearance. It was on its way in. In it goes! The goal for 1-0. And that changes the dynamic. Monu. Maritz. Kim Little. Williamson Katie McCabe Frida Mornu Well, very effective play in possession And the keeper really reacted brilliantly Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say No frustration for those waiting in the middle So a goal kick is what's coming up here Jess Carter. Alsu Abdulina. Free kick to Chelsea. Trying to open up the defence. Oh, it almost did the trick for them. Great defending. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Promising looking attack. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned. Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. From one side of the pitch to the other. 
Well, she's certainly not alone. Has a go! And look at that! A goal here for Arsenal, who now have got themselves on terms. Ashley Lawrence. Svitkova. James. Sophie Ingle. On to Mead. Arsenal have given it away. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Lauren James. Now here's Kerr. Big chance! Well, didn't really make the keeper think too much about that in the end. And what a waste that is. Such a good chance as well. 30 minutes left for play. Maritz. The switch of play now. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Decent looking pass. Well, they have it again. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Happy to take on the shot. Great defending. Kerr, just moving back into that deeper position. Fired in there quickly. And a good take under duress there. Monum. Russo. Wonderfully weighted pass. Kim Little. Maritz. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Frida Monum. Keeping it moving dynamically. Chance to finish. Applying the finishing touch, just what the doctor ordered. Svitkova. Time is against Chelsea, but they can still battle back. Oh, an incredible save to preserve their lead. Well, that's a great stop and probably a match-winning one. Real drama late on here. And teammates around her. They keep plugging away. Oh, genuine chance. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. And quick thinking defensively. Maritz. Now here's Miedema. Dangerous looking through ball. And they could do damage. And she's in the mood today. She's gone and made it a double. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. So the final whistle and Chelsea take nothing at all from it. They weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out.
Nobody like me today the hype has been building up well you can certainly feel the excitement tonight here at the theater of dreams old trafford i'm derek ray and delighted to have stuart robson sharing commentary duties with me and we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you it is manchester united taking on chelsea yes thanks as always derek we've got two good teams here so i'm anticipating a really good game the atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, Manchester United have chosen this particular shape. Well, on paper, it looks a rigid 4-4-2, but watch out for the rotation of the wide players and the forward runs from the central midfield players. They could be a handful today. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Well, 4-4-2 against 4-4-2, that certainly takes me back. But I think this will come down to who wins the battle. Can they convert? And a goal to open the scoring. A very bright start to this one. Abdulina. Svitkova. And Buchanan. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. That's a good-looking pass. This could square the game. 
What a block! Well, the short corner routine. And players waiting at the far post. Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted merely minutes. Nikita Paris. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Lauren James Buchanan on to Lawrence oh it's there for her still could be dangerous James Carter on to Kerr and it might be great defending and inches away didn't miss by very much at all a super tackle and they've won possession lovely ball over the top Harris Thomas Revere the defenders know you can't really allow space like that well capable of a better clearance than that and did just enough defensively Lauren James Katarzyna Svitkova now look at this, they might be able to cash in here. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. And support available. And the referee has awarded a corner following that touch. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? Paris. Well, possibilities in the centre. And the keeper deals with the danger. And there goes the whistle. That close. Second half here at Old Trafford has commenced. James Kadisha Buchanan Ashley Lawrence now can they make something happen a well, fine reading of the situation can they do something positive on the counter attack well it fizzled out well, pressing really high Ashley Lawrence holding on to what they have is the priority apparently and she's done it she's made it a hat-trick she's tearing this defence apart what an individual performance well it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it And in the right position to read it. Now options are plenty.
Manchester United not properly keeping hold of the ball here. That's a good looking ball. And the decision offside here. Soon. And just blotting out the danger. Katarzyna Svitkova. Sam Kerr. Lauren James. Oh, she's made a crucial tackle there. That's a good looking shot. Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. And an astute piece of defending. Ella Toon. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Could reduce the deficit. And in it goes. And you never know in this game. They might yet be able to level it. Jess Carter. Sophie Ingle. Alsu Abdulina. Lawrence. Well, it's such an eye-catching series of passes. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Ivana Fuso. Oh, nice ball. A very good tackle. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And that is full time. Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area. And they also look threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them.
sitting lonely in my room again I'm Trying to find the words to say but nothing comes out I am looking for the better day You seem like they just stay away whenever I try There's so many things that I keep in my mind My friends keep me out and it hurts every time With all the emotions I built up inside Oh, why can't I? Will someone look for me if I disappear? No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears But I see the light from far away, it's down the line Maybe I should not give up without a fight Cause there will be a time Oh, oh Sitting lonely in my room again Acting like I'm innocent Why do I try? Cause now I'm feeling like a fool again Thinking I can fool myself by telling me lies When there's so many things that I keep in my mind I hang around people I don't even like If they can be happy and walk with a smile Oh why? Can't I? The stadium is buzzing already and with good and good evening to you from this beautifully appointed stadium the home of Arsenal here in North London I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson and we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you it's Arsenal up against Manchester United well thanks Derek as always the scene is set two good teams a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere it has all must be and a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, real quality all around. How about that free kick? And how about the save? Played over. Oh, disappointing clearance. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. And United regaining possession here. Still a chance! Well, thank goodness for the goalkeeper. Well, they're calm now, but that initial save was absolutely magnificent. Williamson. Maritz. Here's Little now. Midema. Good patient build up as they try to fashion something. And angling it back. And a goal! Now they have their opener. And now they can celebrate. Ella Toon. Fuso. Williamson. Katie McCabe. Our possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Noel Maritz. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. And a fine reading of the situation. Trying her luck. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, a vital interception to snuff out the danger. Portig. Miedema, and there's the feed into the box. She needs to get it out of there. Fuso. 
Martha Thomas. Good tackle. Leah Williamson. McCabe. Arsenal pushing forward with options available. Fantastic work to thwart the danger. The outcome is a goal kick here. Jade Revere. Soon. Well, can they prize them open now? Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. Well, the half-time whistle fast approaching. It's Arsenal with the lead. Stuart, interested to get your thoughts on their performance so far. Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half-time. Beth Mead. Now here's Miedema. Chance here. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, that's a sad end to the attack. An effective challenge. So, half-time. So, the match has restarted here in Manchester. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Viviana Miedema. Portig. Still could be dangerous. And a goal! Well, it looks easy when you can put them away like that. 2-0 here, and the ball is moving again. Ivana Fuso. Jade Revere. Not showing good defensive judgment. Thomas. Could cross it in here. Well, the cross needed to be better than that one. Advantage, Arsenal. Kim Little. Happy to shoot. Crucial piece of defending. And into the last 30 minutes now. Disappointing for United to give it away like that. Oh, danger here. Oh, genuine chance. And fine goalkeeping. Keen to take it short here. They keep plugging away. In position. And there is the goal. Well, that changes the equation. And they have the momentum now. Beth Mead and Little Noel Maritz great strong tackle throw in forthcoming 20 minutes to go throw in here for Arsenal a really good pass Alessia Russo. Chance to play it in. Pulls it back. Oh, that's a run of the mill as saves go. Me. Ivana Fuso. And passing it through. 
And a goal it is. The keeper really not part of the equation. Williamson. Great vision to switch the play. And with the teams locked together, Arsenal chasing and chasing that winner. It's been aimed towards the front first. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Ella Toon. And possession lost, intercepted. Brilliant pass. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. And we will. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Oh, nice ball. Takes aim. Oh, it's off the post. Prepare to take on the shot. That is that after 90 minutes. They... Hopeless solution. 
to be a voyeur on an occasion. Always oh, a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And we've got pulsating league action coming up for you. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. And outfoxing her opponent. Well then there to tidy up. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. An Arsenal corner. Well, it still could be dangerous. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Just the challenge that was required. Svitkova, Lauren James, and Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Can they forge ahead? Oh, my word. There's excellent timing for you. What a challenge. Shot attempted. A goal! They've opened the scoring in the derby. And I'll tell you what, you can hear a pin drop in here. Now back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Frida Mornu. McCabe. The switch of play now. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Svitkova. Oh, what a top-notch pass. Well, a fierce effort, but quite simply not accurate enough. Frida Mornu. McCabe. Now, who can she pass it to? Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Carter. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Well, she's playing with a purpose. Genuine chance. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. And she's being egged on by the crowd. Not to be in terms of the cross there. Goal kick coming up. Needed to be more accurate from the keeper. Beth Mead. Here's Little now. Arsenal have given it away. Ingle. Now with Wrighton. Sophie Ingle. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Alessia Russo. Might really be able to trouble them here. 
Can she get them level? And what a magical save it was! Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Oh, an incredible clearance. I must say, I didn't see that coming. And there it is, the referee's whistle. And the second half has begun here in North London. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Oh, great vision. Nicely saved. And over it comes. And off the crossbar. So unfortunate. Well, I thought that was in Derek. She struck it so sweetly. Plenty of power. She can't come much closer than that. Frida Mornu. Now here's medium up, and there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Over the touchline for what will be an Arsenal throw. Really well played pass. And players waiting in the centre. Well, the threat was very real, marvellous defending. Well, she's certainly not alone. Frida Mornu. Kortig. So, a half an hour remaining. Given away by Chelsea. Opportunity here. Oh, her volley was close. High degree of difficulty. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but she's caught it well. Very unfortunate. Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Amanda Illestet. Here's Little now. The cross is on. Opportunity to level it. And look at that. A goal here for Arsenal, who now have got themselves on terms. Kadisha Buchanan. Just 20 minutes remaining now. And now they sense victory. Ashley Lawrence. Katarzyna Svitkova. What can Chelsea do from this position? Svitkova. Skipping away. And that was a very fine read. Feeding it through. Chelsea will get the throw in. Had a chance to whip it in here. This could square the game. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. And passing it well. Well, just trying to drive her team forward here. Well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. Oh, how about that for the last line of defence? Might work out. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Breaking at pace. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. And the flag has gone up, offside.
The final whistle then. The referee says that will be all. Not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time.
The tension is palpable and you can understand. Well, it really is a city that loves its football. I'm talking, of course, about Manchester. And it's a real pleasure to be here tonight at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The seat. Is this the moment? Oh, it was a fantastic opportunity to make it 1-0 right at the start of this contest. Oh, what a chance to open the score in there. They have to do better than that. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Well, they're going to set up as a 4-4-2, which means the front two will need to be clever with their combination. It should be! And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Martha Thomas, Fuso, encouraging stuff from United, soon, and a chance to level it, that is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances, and a goal here, just what Manchester United required, they are level. Abdulina, perfectly positioned to take it away. Might lead to a chance. Will it be? And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And there's the delivery. Clears it away. Giving it a try. That is how to keep it out of the net. Lawrence. And passing it through. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. The Chelsea move still flowing. Advantage to them. Distributing it well. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Jade Revere. It's a fine United move in the making. Must take the lead here. And what a magical save it was. Corner kick played in. Oh, excellent diving stop. Well, another corner hot on the heels of the last one. Now in a more than decent position. Stopped a certain goal. Can they jump in front? Well, what a stop that was. So the corner played into the box. And that is cleared it away. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Super stop. Svitkova. On to Reiten. Genuine chance, and a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved! Soon. More than decent this from United. Can she score? Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Oh, that's a really good pass. And you cannot argue with a hat-trick. Simply unstoppable today. Fuso. Martha Thomas. Really good build-up, but no end product. What can she do with it now? Oh, big opportunity. Can they put it away? Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. And so the first half story has been... 
Well, off and running again, and it was a sublime performance by Chelsea in the first half. Will we see more of the same in the second 45? Martha Thomas. United might be able to cash in. Could pull one back here. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Well, this has to be their way back into the game. The crowd are certainly playing their part. Ella Toon. Shaping to shoot. Well, not straightforward, but that was a chance to give themselves life. And it was close, but if they're going to get back into this, they need to score from those sort of chances. Did look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Brighton. Ivana Fuso. It did look on for them, but not to be. Alsu Abdulina. 30 minutes left for play. And Chelsea looking dangerous, but nothing comes of it. Could be! Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Brighton. Carter. That's a lovely ball. Clearly took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw in to come. Options in the centre. Chance here. And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Real chance. Oh, not to be. Stopping a certain goal. Thomas. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Chance to finish. And there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Martha Thomas. Well, the fans want to see a shot, and just over the bar, really good effort. Ingle, good ball over the top, and a decent delivery, sound piece of defending. Nice weight on the pass. Oh, well, now in a dangerous position. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Now sending it in. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Brighton. Distributing it well. Save, but still a chance. And problem solved for now. And so there it is. That just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me.
is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to a lot of ideal weather no complaints on that front here in north london at the emirates stadium i'm derek ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is stuart robson and we've got potentially exciting league action coming up on the menu for you it's arsenal taking on manchester united thanks derek well often we talk about the tactics the individual players players that are missing but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question And this is the Arsenal starting 11. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the full-back and winger, and, of course, the centre-backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, it's 4-4-2 against 4-4-2. You don't see that very often these days. But I'm sure we're going to see slightly different versions of it once the game gets going, particularly in the wide areas. McCabe. Miedema. Illestet. Maritz. Leah Williamson. Amanda Illestet. Katie McCabe. Alessia Russo. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Miedema. Real chance. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Playing it in. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Oh, she's in a really promising position. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. Me. And Little. Me, Demar. McCabe. Well, it's one pass after another. Well, they're doing their best to get on level terms here. Well, it's a decent effort, but they're still trailing. They need something special here. Revere. Harris. She's made a really good intervention there. Alessia Russo. Really nice ball. Oh, my goodness. Such a classy goal. Well, that's one to take your breath away. A volley par excellence. And no wonder she's celebrating. Ivana Fuso. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Can they forge ahead? And able to close down the shots. Maritz, Frida Mornu, McCabe. Well, there's a living, breathing example of positional sense. Miedema, Kurtig. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Advantage, Arsenal, the delivery, a very effective clearance. Could take the lead, and a goal! In the lead again, fully deserved! And the whistle... The second half has begun here in North London. Oh, big chance. Well, she's fed penalty in the opinion of the referee. And this is seriously getting away from them. 
Is it going to be 3-1? And the keeper denies them from the spot. In it goes. She snaps up the second chance. Frustration from the goalkeeper. So back underway. 3-1 the score. Kim Little. Arsenal have given it away. Oh, it might be. No way through. Beth Mead. Crossing into the middle. Flag raised for offside. Went in strongly, decisively. Kim Little. Mornum. Is it going to be? Shot blocked, but still alive. Oh, a superb save. Arsenal did well to win back possession. Russo. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Able to close down the shot. Fuso. Has a go. Blocked it brilliantly. Not covering up defensively. Failure to keep the ball by United. Alessia Russo. It's going to be United's free kick. And a timely intervention. Trying to really get at the opposition here. Chance to play it in. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Thomas. And still pressing. Superbly read and executed. Ten minutes to go then. And passing it well. And giving the ball to the opposition that time. Out of play and an Arsenal throw in forthcoming. Noel Maritz. Now with Mead. Oh, it's there for her. Oh, and a venomous effort. Rattling the crossbar. Well, what a good shot that was. Hit with such power, but it just didn't come down in time. And super tackle, and they've won possession. Lots of space for Arsenal. Beth Mead. Could be. And there it is. She's done it. They're just a goal behind now, and you never know. Martha Thomas. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. So the final whistle now. Certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance.
wouldn't want to be a voyeur on an occasion such as this one. Ideal weather, no complaints on that front here in North London at the Emirates Stadium. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we're very much looking forward to bringing you league action today. It's Arsenal taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Well, here is the lineup for the hosts today. Well, if they're going to play. Oh, look at this, they must score! And striking it on the volley, just no luck. Well, good technique, but just wide of the target. Well, far from the ideal pass, you've got to say. McCabe, an encouraging Arsenal move. Williamson. Katie McCabe. Kim Little. Good work from Chelsea to win back possession. Now what can they do from here? And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all. Maritz. Russo. Still on level terms. Moving the ball nicely. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And over it comes. And still dangerous. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Katie McCabe. Pass after. And it's opening up. There it is! The first goal in the derby. A 
special moment. Maritz. Illestet. Noel Maritz. Williamson. Casey McCabe. Mornum. Really good ball there. her second goal of the game she's proving to be so difficult to play against here Sam Kerr on to Wrighton Sophie Ingle Abdulina attacking possibilities for Chelsea Ingle opportunity here great defending Amanda Illestet, advantage, Arsenal. Noel Maritz. Kerr. It needs an accurate cross. That is tackling of the highest order. Frida Mornu. McCabe. Lina Hurtig. Crossing opportunity. Not at all problematic for the goalkeeper. And so it is, the first half story. So back underway here, into the second half. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Frida Mornu. How about the cross? Katie McCabe. And Arsenal now find themselves in potentially a dangerous position. Every pass hitting its target. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Counter-attacking chance. Promising pass. Well, it petered out. Williamson. Frida Mornu. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Little. And the ruling is offside here. Kerr. Svitkova. Arsenal regaining possession. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. And passing it well. Sound piece of goalkeeping. Brighton pulls it back and there it is still life left in this game and they have the momentum now so underway once more and the push is on from Chelsea can they find a leveller Noel Maritz realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank went in strongly decisively Ball played nicely. Katarzyna Svitkova. Big 
chance to get them on terms. An absolutely breathtaking spell. We were ready to write them off, but not anymore. All square now. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Little. Miedema. On to Mead. Chance to cross. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. Must take the lead here. Stopped a surefire goal. And Arsenal have won the corner as they try to take the lead. Well, just listen to these. And a goal! Just like that, they're back in front. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Lauren James. Time is against Chelsea, but they can still battle back. And let's give credit to the defending. Lina Hurti. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw-in then. And fine work from Arsenal to win it back. Crossing possibilities. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Now, oh, quite simply, the cross was too close to the keeper. Svitkova. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Katarzyna Svitkova. Oh, might be. And foiled by the post. And problem solved for now. And the referee signals at this game. It... It's a poor result. It was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way. But in the end, they will be disappointed. Sitting lonely in my room again Acting like I'm innocent Why do I try? Cause now I'm feeling like a fool again Thinking I can fool myself by telling me lies When there's so many things that I keep in my mind I hang around people I don't even like If they can be happy and walk with a smile Oh why can't I? Will someone look for me if I disappear? No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears. But I see the light from far away, it's down the line. Maybe I should not give up without a fight. Cause there will be a time. Oh, oh.
vibes in my mind, I can't get them out. No matter how hard I try, I need you and your heart next to mine. Yeah, I'm all about keeping it you and I. When you're here, you spark chemical reactions. Your aura strikes like lightning. Got no words, I'm just drowning in attraction. Only one way to describe it. To a lot on the line. And welcome everyone to England's Northwest. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And we've got what we hope will be exciting league action coming up for you. It is Manchester United taking on Chelsea. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. A glorious chance. There it is, and just the ideal start. Soon. Martha Thomas. Decent position this for United to find themselves in, and they deal with the threat this time. United doing well to regain possession. Paris. Teammate available. Oh, it was there for her to get them on level terms. Well, no doubt about it. That was a big miss to draw level there. Katarzyna Svitkova. Can they find a gap in the defence? Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. In with a chance. It has to be, surely. Well, she was up to the task. She's missed it, and what a glorious chance it was. Well, she knows it. That should have been a goal there. Brighton. Katarzyna Svitkova. Having to shoot. Oh, great block. And Chelsea pushing to add to their lead. It'll be a corner. And a useful cross. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Fuso. Encouraging stuff from United. Thomas. It might be. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. And giving the ball away. Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Well, they're playing well now, and these fans can sense a goal coming. Nicely timed tackle. Thumps clear. Counter attacking chance. And quick thinking defensively. Sophie Ingle. Brighton. And support available. Lawrence. And wasteful from Chelsea.
Platoon. Martha Thomas. Can she get them level? Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Read it well, cleared it well. The delivery. Well, not an attempt she'll be especially proud of. Goal kick. Brighton. Sophie Ingle. And defensive play to be applauded. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Trying to open up the defence. And it's in! A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. So the two teams have switched around, and the second half is underway. Trying her luck. Well, the keeper in position to prevent another goal from her. Well, there she is again. She certainly looked a major threat here today. I'll tell you what, that is really top-class defending. Chance to put them in front. Can they put it away? Brilliantly blocked. Well, those stats tell you what a good game this has been. We've seen a lot of good attacking play, plenty of goal mouth action, and all done at a high tempo. It's been very entertaining so far. And able to close down the shots. Kerr. This could be troublesome. Oh, and a penalty has been awarded. Big moment here. Can they get themselves ahead? And a chance to restore their advantage. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. In the right place to cut out the pass. Sophie Ingle. Katarzyna Svitkova. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. And an astute piece of defending. Fuso. Getting forward. Oh, it might be. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Over it comes. Smuggled away. Breaking at pace. Well read to ease the pressure. Sam Kerr. Incisive pass. Oh, she wasn't necessarily favourite to win that challenge. Ella Toon. Good looking sequence. But nothing comes of it. Lauren James. Now here's Kerr. Katarzyna Svitkova. Oh, this looks useful. Could be nicely blocked. So Chelsea get ready for their set-piece routine, hoping to increase their lead. Can she create an angle? And still dangerous. Buchanan. Oh, winning back possession. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. Well, this is building up to a nail-biting finish. These United fans are making so much noise. Can they get an equaliser here? A 
And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Oh, that's fine defensive play. And she's produced a really important save to keep the pot boiling here. Well, there's not long left, but she's kept her team in this one. That's a great save by the keeper. Well, it's a textbook example of dynamic passing. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And so there it is, the final whistle. And... They weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out. It makes sense, it must be the temptation speaking. What am I supposed to do? Cause it feels so good. Feeling wild like a super me in a mood. I should've known that